getting some news is really hard when you're young. Okay, so okay, let's do the button. <laughs> Welcome to today's video. Hola, nudes. Say hi, baby. Hi. <laughs> so, guys, I've never given Newt a bath before because I've only had her for about three weeks now, and she got sick in the beginning, so I couldn't give her a bath. But today, we're going to give her a bath, and I'm so excited actually because you smell a little bit, Newt. Uh, it's her first bath, and it's my first time giving a bath to a doggy, so it's a first for us both. And I thought I would just film a video, give you guys the tips I've gotten from people and from YouTubers and you know just from researching online I thought I would just share the tips I've got even though I'm not an expert at all I could be saying the wrong things so let's get started guys I'm going to use it, be using the aloe vera or dog shampoo and it's soap free I've read that you should use soap free uh, shampoo I could be wrong, who knows. This one was 300 pesos, I think, in SM. A lot of people just use shampoo, but I'm going to be using the extra moisture conditioner, our dog as well. It's the partner of that one. And I'm only going to be giving you a bath once a month because I read from Cesar Milan himself, the dog whisperer, the dog trainer, that you should only give your dog a bath once a month unless they're super, super dirty and really need a bath. So what I read is that you should brush your dog before you give them a bath and I'm going to remove her collar and then you should brush them to remove the excess fur so that when you give them a bath, the fur isn't just going to like go everywhere and apparently it will also like remove excess dirt so you don't get that in your bathtub if you're going to shower them in your bathtub. You can barely see her though because she's the same color as the floor. Another tip I heard was to close the door so they don't escape because she will escape. The first thing is to wet her thoroughly from the neck down and don't wet her face. The face should not get wet. Apparently you should only use a cloth for the face. So, it's okay. I'm getting wet too though. It's okay. No, no, no. <laughs> have to do this really, really quickly. I guess she moves a lot. Okay. There's a paw. There's a tummy. There we go. It's not so bad. This one guy he just lifted <laughs> his dog's tail and then put water on the butt. <laughs> so. Because that's what I'm going to do too. Now let's get the shampoo going. I don't think he, she needs a bath. I keep on saying he. Well, you're going to be smelling good, nude. She likes this, I think. And I also read that you should do like upwards, like upwards movement. So you brush upwards, get rid of everything, all of the dirt. And in the tummy too, in the tail. You just lick some of the shampoo, well, that's okay. No take this. Wait, maybe you shouldn't lick that. Sorry guys, new dog owner here. I know nothing yet. Ah, oh, I think she's more calm if she's on my lap. I won't be able to do this when she's an adult though. And you have to really like thoroughly, thoroughly remove all of the water to make sure that there's no like soap left or else they might like get allergies, stuff like that. Getting sunburns is really hard when you're young. Okay, so okay, let's do the button. <laughs> Step. 
almost done. By the way, I made sure to give her a walk before this to make sure she won't like pee in here. <laughs> and so she would be like more calm. I read walking apps. If you guys know any easier way to give your dog a bath, make sure it's right down below. Because I know that he also took a shower right now. The only thing that is left is drying her off. Yay! She did so good! Now I can finally like hug her. Something I've read that is really important to do is not to fall. <laughs> Something that's really important is that you dry them off so that they don't get sick. Especially if they have like short hair like Newt. But if you guys are living in a place like we are which is very tropical and really warm then you really, you can just dry them off with a towel and then they will get dry outside by themselves because they're going to shake off and everything. And actually Newt is already getting dry so it's really easy to dry them off. Oh my gosh, it smells so good! Mm. She really did not enjoy that experience. She really did not like it. But you know, at least she's clean now. If your dog is like long haired, then you should definitely brush them after washing them. But Newt has really short hair and really easy to maintain. So I don't really have to brush her afterwards, but I still do it. Guys, that is it for the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I really enjoyed making this one because I've always wondered if it really is hard to, you know, give your dog a bath. And yes, it is. Like, I've seen the movies, I've seen the YouTube videos, and it does. It looks really hard because the dogs usually don't like the water, so they will run away like Newt tried to do. And then you have to worry, like, to not get their ears wet. Her ears aren't wet, so. And this, guys, is the best way for them to cool, to dry off because the sun is out. And she's looking so good. She's so shiny. Yeah! Newtie! Hi! Oh, you did not like that. And now she's going to get all dirty from the sand and everything. She's so shiny now though. Newt, come here! You are such a good girl. Now don't go to the soil. I thank you. This is her favorite toy. Yay! I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Tell me down below how did I do for my very first time. How did Newt do for her first time? What do you guys think about all of the tips and stuff? Just leave your comments down below with anything, any topics that you want. And also tell me what do you want me to do next with you? What video do you want us to do next? Thank you so much guys for watching. Please go down below and subscribe to this channel. Art the Beauty Freak and turn on the post notifications so you guys know when I upload a new video. Thanks guys and make sure to follow me on my social medias at RADF and V011. So yeah, thanks for watching. Gracias, perfect. Good job, Nude. And we'll see you next week. Adios, amigos.